Watching Emily Regan on the water means watching the power and athleticism of an Olympic champion. And she's quick to point out who did so much to inspire that success. You'd get lectures in the, uh, yeah. in the car. <laughs> I would. Some coaching maybe a little bit. Just a little. <laughs> Sports coaching, life coaching maybe. T tell us about yeah. that, what those conversations Well, like. I mean, in the moment it definitely felt like sports coaching, but now that I'm a little bit older, I, I can understand that it was more life coaching. It's an approach he took with all four of his children who achieved success on the basketball court, and in Emily's case, on the water. A gold medal in Rio back in 2016 as part of the U.S. Women's Eight in Roy. There's no way I could have been successful without that calming, reassuring voice and positive influence in my life. Sadly, Larry Regan, a man of so much influence in his family and beyond, passed away in December. He had limited treatment options due to a prior kidney transplant and so nothing to stop skin cancer from spreading. As big as he was, his heart was bigger, and he just really cared for people, and he wanted he wanted the best for everyone. He truly did, and um, so that is really the reason that we all could do this. This is the Regan family taking part in this year's ride for Roswell in Larry's memory. Emily and her aunt Colleen are set to ride 100 miles. There really weren't treatment options for him. Um, and so I, I just want to be able to help there be treatment options for people in situations like him. What would he think of that effort? My dad would be so incredibly proud. Um, he did so much in his life to help other people and I think seeing us doing what we can to help other people would be one of the greatest joys he could have. How much would Larry have wanted that? He'd want to help others. I mean, that's what he was always all about. So I know this would make him so happy, and I'm sure he's watching. Watching as his son Will will ride Larry's bike on Saturday, and watching as his daughter's success is celebrated, Emily will be inducted this year into the Greater Buffalo Sports Hall of Fame, now a coach at Boston University and now helping to lead a Regan family effort to raise money and take part in her first ride for Roswell. And so I'm grateful that I'm able to take on a new challenge and really appreciate what the ride for Roswell really does for the community because on the outside looking in, you, you know, but you don't know until you get to be a part of it. And it's incredible. I mean, all sports, especially when you're training for the Olympics are emotional, but the whole like big picture of this is more emotional because I know how proud my dad would be. Pride. Perseverance. And passion. Continuing a legacy of helping others. Adam Benini, Channel 2 Sports.